Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. Breaking news. Edo APC writes letter to Obaseki. Says, our loss was due to irresponsible, selfish leaders. My people, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whatever time we're reaching you today, a very warm big thank you to you. Thank you so much for supporting us. Well, we all know of the victory that happened on Saturday where Governor Gordon Obaseki was re-elected as the governor of Edo State, despite in spite of the heavy weight that we are against him. You know that um, APC Edo State constantly wanted Governor Gordon Obaseki to stay. But there is one man we call the APC, former APC uh, um, NWC chairman, Adam Sushumole, who because of his own personal issues with uh, Baseki, you know, made APC to lose a candidate like Governor Godwin or Baseki. You saw, we heard um, Aslam Muzojo, the chairman of APC in Edo State, who said is is not happy that Governor Gordon Obaseki did not win the governorship ticket again under the APC platform. That he's happy he won the election, but he would have been happier if it was won under the APC platform. You see, he said this is due to the fault of uh, our leaders, some people who want their will to be done at all costs. This is very, very, you know, this is, uh, this is very, on, on, they are not happy about it, you see, and they are fi finally written out to Governor Gordon Obaseki. Let's get all the details. Edo APC writes letter to Obaseki, says their loss was due to irresponsible, selfish leaders. Just after Edo State Governor, His Excellency Governor Gordon Obaseki received his certificate of return from INEC along with his deputy, Philip Shaibo, the... Leadership of APC in Edo State have written to congratulate him and his deputy. Obaseki and Shaibu got issued their return certificate yesterday. You could see the pictures and we're also sending you the letter. You could expand it on it, stop it, just expand it with your hand and you can read the letter for yourself. According to the letter, the entire election process was free and fair and credible, says Edo APC. Obaseki and APC State Chairman, they're also there. The letter which was signed by the uh, state chairman of the party, Barrister Aslam Ozoje, said, among other things, that the loss, the, the, the loss of APC during the election was due to the leadership crisis which rocked the party and majorly due to the selfish and irresponsible attitude of the leadership hierarchy. He further asked everyone involved in the election to shield their sword because the election was over now and it was time to concentrate on an enormous task ahead of the governor and his deputy, which he said would be the, in the best interest of the Edo people. Recall that Governor Gordon Obaseki initially in the APC was disqualified from running for the party ticket, which prompts is decamping to the People Democratic Party, where he became the flag bearer and eventually the winner and made Edo State a PDP state. Aslan Muzoji said, I am happy the governor won the election, but I would have been happier if it was under the APC. He's supposed to win it under us because we love him and we were there to support him. But selfish leaders did not allow us. They forced it down our throats by getting him off the party. There are hierarchy in leadership, and there was little or nothing we could actually do. We want to say formally congratulations to Governor Gordon Obaseki. We pledge to support you and to work with you for Edo State to become better than it has ever been before. We are one and the same persons, and we hope that you will work alongside with us. That is wonderful, my brother Aslam Uzoje. You are a man. You are truly a man. I want to personally say well done for that wonderful statement you just made. I want to personally say you are truly the son of your father. You see, that's um, Aslam Uzoje speaking and you know talking to the people of APC that it is time to shield sword, it is time to work together, um, which is, I mean, excellent. 
I mean, excellent. There is nothing more I can say to that. You see, uh, he said he would have been happier if Governor Gordon Obaseki has actually won this party ticket under the People Democratic, under the uh, uh, APC. He said because APC was where Governor Gordon Obaseki started from. They all love him. They all worked, wanted, you know. But, you know, I mean, he was shoved down our throats. I mean, it's evident. There was no lie about that. They practically pushed Abaseki out of the party. You saw how he was unjustly disqualified. I mean, there was little or nothing any other person could do since the very chairman of the party, Adam Soshumole, uh, was there. There was little or nothing anybody could really have done. That's the truth. You know, if you are not the chairman and um, with the position, that's why we, we should be praying for good leaders. Honestly, we should be praying for good leaders because if you have a if you have a bad leader, it can determine. It can either make you or mar you because the decision of the leader decide depends on where the tendency of what you know the direction in which things will move. If you have a good leader, then is able to give adequate direction, and you can see people moving forward and people making progress but if he gives a wrong direction he's the leader and uh, they say follow the leader <laughs> if you know that song you know so i mean that's it is what it is you see as Muzuji is writing to congratulate obaseki saying we will work together we will work with you your brother uh nobody should you know uh give the governor any form of uh consign or anything we should work together and make sure that the governor make a do state a better state we are pledging our support to say that we are working together with you if you will accept to work with us and i think this is uh, this is a lesson you know to a lot of people this is actually a lesson to lots of nigerians to say come let's work together let's stop fighting fighting will not lead us anywhere if we work together as one we will truly see true change you see so my people this is what it is today uh, this is what is happening uh my dear aslam muzuji has spoken it all what is there more to say than to say edo state congratulations apc that was really bold i mean you you were defeated some people would just rather bury their faces and their head in shame but you have not done that you have come out boldly to say uh, we congratulate you that is a formal congratulatory message we congratulate you we are going to work with you and uh, we are coming alongside with you my people this is what is happening this is where we are today as we speak uh, APC Edo State has formally congratulated uh, you know uh, Governor Gordon Obaseke I hope that uh, Pastor Sage Ize Iyam will not be deceived to spend his many money in court case because we heard him saying that they were, they were examining the numbers and afterward they will speak. I hope he will not be deceived to say, go to court, go to court. Listen, if you go to court, you will stand alone. Let's be honest. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let's just take it the way it is and let us give God the glory and move on, okay? It is what it is. What has happened has happened, but the truth of the matter is we can make a whole lot of difference if we work together, if we say we will stand together as one. Anyway, guys, what do you think? Leave us a comment, like, and share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can always get all our latest news. God bless you. Bye for now.